Yeah. How you feeling? I'm feeling good. Feeling good. Feeling yeah. good. Just having surgery uh, two weeks out. You know, uh, at the end of April I'll be back. Be back full go, full healthy, and ready to go. So hurting? You know, take a chance. Yeah. When did that pop up? Huh? When did that pop up? Uh, you know, I've been dealing with it the whole year. Been dealing with it the whole year. Uh, you know, really found out about it when I went down to training. Uh, we got it done. And, you know, I'm ready. Yeah. So, uh, after my rehab, I'm ready to go in six, about six, four more weeks a month. So the testing numbers you did at the combine, you did. Not yet. Well, not with test numbers. I did. I wasn't full. Good. I wasn't full hundred percent. No, I was about seventy, maybe eighty, seventy, eighty percent. Was there, no, if that. Was there, was there a thought about having the surgery sooner and then putting off the combine? Nah, no, there's no thought about putting off the combine. Nah, combine was definitely going to be done. Uh, that was all my decision. You know, I was going to run a combine no matter what. Uh, you know, as far as surgery went, you know, like, you know, we game planned and talked after. A couple weeks after, and decided to get it done. Do you like have a sense now then how the surgery then affects your stock or kind of where you are? No, nah, I, I don't think I don't think the surgery has any hold any hurt on me at all. I mean, it's a real quick surgery. Uh, there's no pain. I mean, you know, I'm good. How much excitement is there? You know, building that this is it's getting close. You know, we're getting to that time. I mean, it's something you've been dreaming about, right? I'm anxious, man. You know, I'm nervous. I'm anxious. Uh, you know, it's, I just want to be here already, you know. I just want to get it done with, uh, you know, not me. I'm enjoying the experience. You know, a lot, not a lot of people get to be in my shoes, you know, and uh, yeah, I'm blessed. You know, that's, I'm just taking it for what it is, and thank you, thank you, God, man, upstairs, you know. Remember the first time you thought about possibly playing one day in the NFL? Oh, uh, man, definitely when I was a little kid. I mean, you know, you dream about that. You, you dream about being a little, you know, you're watching watching all your favorite football players play. You're watching all your favorite sports teams. You're cheering these guys on. And you want to be in their shoes. And, you know, I'm right there now. I'm so close to it, you know. And we'll see what happens in April. April 28th when the draft day starts. So we'll see what happens.